Good morning, everybody. It's Neon Tiger. How you doing? Welcome back to Sturdy Valley. <gasps> the parsnip screw. Yay! That's awesome. No, do not eat that parsnip. Throw it in the dank thing. Um. There's a lot of stones scattered around your farm. Oh, Robin here. If you store plus, you make it start having me build a well for you. Wells can be placed all over your farm, and service can be in places for your watering can. Just swing my stops to 75 stones and 100G when you're ready for it. Okay. So, I guess... We can we could buy one. But I think we've got the water situation to take care of right, right now. So, parsnips. Parsnips. Yay! Get all the parsnips. And we'll throw those in there. Um, so journal. Done. Getting started. Oh, we got 100 gold out of it. Cool. Uh, raising animals. Build a coop. An urban local carpenter. Leaves an extra town. Exchange for materials and money. She'll construct new buildings for you. You need to build a car coop or barn so you can raise animals. Alright. Advancement. Uh, reach farming level 1 and craft a scarecrow. So let's see here. Oh. Collections, crafting. Okay, we can craft uh, a cherry bomb. A chest. Oh, we need 50 wood. Crap! Why didn't I check this in the first place? Why am I an idiot? Alright, we're going to build a chest. I don't know why I didn't check the crafting screen in the first place. I'm a dummy butt. I didn't realize you could craft things. That's fine. We'll, we'll get through this together, everybody. You guys, will, you guys, you guys are gonna be able to put up with my dumb stupidity. Trust me, I'm by far the biggest idiot you will ever see playing this game, and I am totally, totally allowed to make fun of myself all the time. All right, grab all the wood. Grab all the wood. I wish I had known that. I would have made a chest last night. I didn't realize that crafting was a thing. Because I didn't pay attention. Well, the good news is when we start streaming this game, it's going to make things a lot easier. With all the derp that we've had. Alright. So there we go. Getting things done. That's what we do around here. So what else can we craft since I am able to take a look? Wood path, gravel path, cobblestone path, campfire, um, gates, wood fence. We want the chest. I'm like 100% certain that we want the chest. Because that's been our problem that we've had for like ever now. It's just we have all this crap and we have nowhere to store it. I've just been doing it the hard way. So now we're going to build a chest and resources. Okay. How many more do I need? Uh, I need another nine. Oh, I need eight now. I'm guessing I'll be able to clear these all out eventually. And I'm sure I'll also be able to chop down trees. I think that's probably another thing that I'll eventually get the tools for. Uh, so. Grab all the wood. I'm trying to do this as quick as I can because I know that I am on a tight schedule here with all of the available stuff. So 45, 46. 47, three more. Okay, we got this. 48, 49, and Fifterino. All right, so we'll go over here. Go to crafting, make a chest. And where are we gonna put this chest? Um, can we put it? We gotta go inside and put it down somewhere, right? Yay, chest! Alright. So, we can throw 
all the things that we don't need right now into the chest. Yeah, look at that. Look at how nice our inventory is now. Look at that. It's looking so good. Oh, I'm out of water. Okay. To the watering can. Pick that all back up. Do that. It's only 11.50 a.m. We are making good time on this day, aren't we? We're pretty exhausted, though. So I wonder if... If we're going to have to call it an early day here. Because we've been doing a lot of stuff. It's not even noon yet. Oh, it's a big rock. We may have to even eat some food. <gasps> food. Oh no. We have to go foraging and grab some crap to eat. Grab those fibers. Let's go down here and see if we can find anything. This is kind of a test to see, I guess, if things regrow as well. Oh, there's a horseradish over here. Oh, hey! I can eat that, right? Yeah, eat that horseradish. Get a little bit of energy back. Hey! Got a little bit of everything. Take a look. Cave carrots, duck eggs, rabbit's foot, radishes, pickles, melons, sea cucumbers, winter seeds, chair and rare seeds. Oh. Let's eat this wild horse radish. Okay, I'm just gonna get a little bit of energy back. Just enough to. Oh, there's a castle thing over here. So, what is that? 25 energy. Eat the dandelions. That'll help out. What is this? It's locked. You can use someone inside, though. Okay. How are we doing introductions, by the way? 25 out of 28. So just three more to go. That might take a while, but we'll, we'll get everybody eventually. It's just a matter of time. So let's see if we can find anything else. There's a burb. Uh, is there anything down here? We did find those wild onions here today. Oh, more wild onions. Whoa! There's a lot of them now. These spring onions, at least. up here. Get a whole bunch of them now. That's 20, so that's enough to go sell. Is there anything over here? Any more horseradishes? Nothing? Nothing. Okay. I guess we can always cross back over. Because we just gotta get to that. Oh, there's a horseradish here. We just gotta get to 2,000. If we can get to 2,000 gold, then we're we're golden. <laughs> we get that backpack. I know we've wanted to get that backpack for a while now. Uh, since this flower, can we take the flower daffodil? Okay. A, a traditional spring flower that makes a nice gift. Okay, we'll save that. We'll save that one for uh, for a special occasion when we find somebody that we really want to give something special to. Which will be never. Bachelor for life. <laughs> oh, I hope not. Alright, can throw those in there. And I will make another thing. And plant another seed. And water it. Alright, let's see. Anything up here that we can forage real quick? Take the, take 
the long routes around. See if there's anything that's respawned. It looks like stuff does respawn over time. Which is good. That's great. Um, that's exactly what we want. Oh, horseradish. Okay. I'll take that. Thank you. Anything over here that we can grab? It's just kind of growing wild. Oh, oh. That rock guy is clear. Oh, there's, there's a, a thing over here. We didn't even go over here yet. Proven adventurers only. Well, screw you, too. I guess that's a no-go. Um, there's a cave over here. Do I dare go inside of it? Good question. Very good question. Oh. A guy with a cape and a... Eye patch. Marlin! Oh my goodness. Cape and a patch. He must be adventure. There's no other way. He's gotta be adventure guy. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably a good ore down there. But a dark place, undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore is the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. You might need it. What did we get? <gasps> a sword! You received a rusty sword. No, it's part by the way. You're running adventurous guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself and I might think about making you a member. Good old punished Marlin. Alright, I think we'll have to give it a shot another time. But we can go down there at some point, I'm sure. I think I want I would want the backpack first. Just because having an extra space in case we do find anything is really nice. And you are oh. Can I go inside? Hi, can I talk to you? Oh, aren't you just the one who moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Hi, Maru. <laughs> it's only like been five days. Um, explore the mine. The new mine shaft in town. Okay. So there was a thing over there. That's kind of interesting. That it took me uh, five days to meet somebody. That's great. Nihon, you're amazing. You're amazing at this scheme. No, I'm not. I'm not really good at this at all. I don't know what I'm doing. Why am I whispering to you? <laughs> uh, so let's go ahead and we'll take the uh, the horseradish and daffodils. Or the horseradish and the leeks and throw them in the box. Um, anything in the mailbox? To our really Georgia Mart customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely illegal pursuant to Inerit L61. 091 Georgia Code Amendment. Responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We can apologize for any convenience this may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris. Morris seems like a jerk. I'm just going to say that right now. Morris seems like such a jerk. Oh. TV, no. Uh, let's take a look at the weather report. Welcome to Kosu 5, number one source for weather news. Weather forecast for tomorrow is going to be a clear and sunny day. Awesome. Fortune teller? Ah, yes, I can hear the spirits whispering something to me. The spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. But I think I'm also going to go to bed. Let's, let's see what we get. Level 1 foraging. Axe proficiencies. Trees sometimes drop seeds. Wild seeds. New crafting recipe. Field snack. We got all kinds of things. Farming, 280. Foraging, three, 380. 660 gold. Not bad. Oh, do we almost have enough? I think we almost have enough. Oh, that's going to be next episode. Dang it. Oh, it's going to be next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. We're on to day six next. What's going to happen? Who knows? Who knows?